Hello my lords and ladies, I'm Pitch Dark and welcome back to my let's play of Skyrim The Legend of Maxentius. Uh, this is episode number 16 and um, well we just had a um, pretty bad episode before this. Um, bad as in you know trouble with, with dragons and uh, trying to uh, yes. survive but we managed to get through it. Um, and we stopped in at this inn uh, just to, to get a little break and um, mainly to, to end the episode as well. Um, but we're gonna head on out. We're gonna head to um, um, the the the, the uh, Greybeards and um, and High Rothgar. And um, before I do that, I gotta get my followers here. And um, we're gonna head on out. As I find my horse. All right, so we need to head. Um, let's see, opposite way. So we'll head. We'll go past Helgen, um, and we'll follow this trail through the mountains, and get to Ivanstead. Yeah, so I was thinking about it. I think I'm going to uh, do some enchanting um, on some of my equipment. Try to get better fire and frost protection um, for when we meet, meet up with dragons. Um, clearly, I can't um, can't stand too close to them, it seems. So, hoping that helps out a little bit. Oh, what do we have here? Where's my bow? There we go. Oh, he fell. <laughs> oh, he's gonna get. Oh, my horse. Oh, horse, get away. Get away. Come back. Come back. Come back. Oh, thank you, Carrie. Almost lost another horse. Nice try to me missing. Got him, yeah. Finally, I feel like I killed something. Thought I was gonna lose my horse. Thank you, Carrie, for healing. <laughs> oh. Am I healing more uh, arrows? No. Can't tell with all the rain and the thunder and everything. Right, let's see. Oh, we get arrows here. Did the other guy fall? Oosh. Damn it. Did I do that or did that somebody else do that? Someone else did that, didn't they? There's gotta be somebody else up. Did I do is there a pressure plate over here? Was it just time, like just by going through it? I thought I thought there was a level that they have to pull. I don't know, my followers don't seem to uh, care, so they did for a second, maybe because they got hit by the rocks. Let's see, we'll check it out. I got some kind of status going on over here. Clearly, there's something trying to attack me here somewhere. Oh, yes, it's cool. It's a troll. It's a troll. Run away. Uh, let's see. <laughs> yeah. Leave our friends alone. Especially me. Let's see. 
Well, I'm pretty sure our troll didn't spring that trap, so there must have been something else that caused it. Hey, I don't see any levers, so it must just be when you pass by it that they, they just drop. No oven ball. Bulky shadows, that's pretty nice. Let's check that out. Let's see, I have... Where is my bow? 31. 29. That's well, still better, but... Actually, it would be better for Janessa. Especially since it's Elvish, too. It would look better on her, too. If that is what you wish. Let's see, what does she have? She has a fourth bow, right? That's 22. Yes, yeah, so it would be better, I guess. Very cool. Lead on then. It's nice when you don't have to lead empty handed, have something useful. Alright, let's go get the horses. Did I um, I search this guy? Pidok. Yeah, I've... What's going on? Oh, I think it's when they're running into the, the rocks. Tr it's triggering an attack. Alright. Yeah, I have, I have lost horses there in the past, so... Should have been more careful. Like, I, I rode and just bumped into one of these rocks and it died. <laughs> Alright, so makes sense. This feels pretty good about himself right now, because, you yeah. Actually able to kill something. <laughs> Been feeling like a little slouch lately. He did, he did good against, um... More so, he's got some things to be proud of, and he, he is. Um, here, okay, huh? where are you going? That's weird. I mean, I've, I've seen them hunt, but... I have no idea. I'll leave them to it. Companions? I don't see any more, so... I'm wondering if they're hunting the elk and maybe they just decided to take their swords out or something, I don't know. Every once in a while you do catch them out there hunting, which is pretty cool. Oh, so this is Helgen right here. We have to go through. Not really feeling comfortable about this because of what happened. Oh. We have Is that Lydia? What? Oh, healing potion. 
I, I probably shouldn't go just running into it. Where's she going? Oh, we went through here. Hey, we went through here with Hadlar. Wait. Alright, I'll audition. They were pretty easy. Just, just thieves. That's all. Just bandits. Where'd everybody else go. Yeah, so this is where we ran through with Hagar. Where was the, uh, was that in here? Oh no, it must be further back. I don't think it's stuck in here. Did it jump over there? Okay, yeah, I'll jump over. Alright, we ran through a hollow as well. Is that my horse? Who's my horse? What are you doing in here? Alright, let's get moving. Oh, I hear something. I hear something. We did it. Yeah, these guys are chumps. Alright, let's see. Let's go, uh... What happens if we can go inside where we ran through? Oh, wait. Maybe you help. <laughs> they must have already killed me. I don't want to spend too much time at home. Yeah, they're stuck over here. Alright, let's go. Let me get the horse. Let me get my horse. Get him unstuck. Or get me stuck. Okay. Then I'll just call the boss on the outside. Ah. There we go. Better. 
Alright, I think we want to go this way anyways. I'm going to head off in that direction, so... Excuse me. <laughs> it's like fly over there. Alright, so we... Uh -uh. There we go. I wonder if I can go in this tower. This is the way we came in and work. I missed any. Maybe we can find some potions. It saves something. So why am I looking at it? I don't know. Yeah, it's, it, it's probably nothing in here. We won't waste our time. I actually never knew I could actually do this on the horse. <laughs> the first time I ever tried that. So let's go this way. Let's go. Let's get the obviously get out of this stupid rain. Our stuff's getting worn. I have arrows. Anyways, I have um, not a lot of iron. A lot of iron. There. Definitely need to craft some arrows, some bolts. See, it's almost a runner over. Alright, so it's time to get a colder climate here. I need. That was in the right thing. So I got one for frost resist and I got one for magic resist. And we don't have time to go hunting. What's this? There's someone's horse just sitting around.
I could use a nap. Apparently I'm tired. Winterhold. You want the college there. They teach quite a bit. Right, we just got popped out of nowhere, didn't <laughs> Sorry, I got attacked. Right? Kill you if I have to. Alright. Here we go. Okay. Make sure we go off the path here. Alchemist Shack. Alright, this might be good. Alright. I don't want to steal from the guy. Of course, if I find potions, I'm not going to be too shy about it. Uh, yeah, it's fine. We're honest people. We're not gonna take take from the poor, the poor guy. So obviously when you throw him, he becomes fully healthy. I was wondering what was attacking us. Didn't quite see it. <clears throat> Can't see the sign with the, the glow of my sword. There we go. <laughs> that is bright. Finally made it. Really? He's, he's still lying here? I mean, you, you couldn't just... Oh, maybe just kick him off to the side a little bit. <laughs> no, we're just gonna leave him. Don't mind us. 
Alright. Alright, let's head on up. Or something like that. Where is the shoes? Come on, Lydia. Let's take your time. It's, it's cool. Alright, so hopefully the gray bears know something about the shell power that we need. Can't see a, a shout being the uh, thing that's gonna kill all all the one. But if anybody's gonna know, it's gonna be them. And I don't want to get too far ahead of them <laughs> in case there's a frost troll or something like that up here. This is not real. I specifically could see a cheever and a huge rat. They're acting very strange. So yeah, so I, I do want to get me all the follower, but I need a reason to start heading towards uh, solitude in that direction, so um until that happens, you know, does it doesn't make sense to go get that sword. Uh, not only that, once I do get it, then I need a reason to go back to Riften, so... Um, so I don't think I'm going to be getting her anytime soon. But I guess we'll see. So I'm hit. Uh, so when I hit number two for my bow, showing the dragon bane sword. Is that what's going on? All right. I noticed I was showing the dragon bane sword, and I switched, but I couldn't. Okay. I thought maybe my buttons got screwed up or something. But, huh? It's just that that's the sword it wants to show when I switch. But just fine. Enough. I guess that's the one bad thing about never wanting to fast travel. Sometimes you go through. I don't know why that came up on the top of the screen there. Sometimes you go through um, places that you know you just can't really travel, and it just takes a long time. So fast travel probably would be better, but I just don't like it. Anyways, look at this. I'd, I'd miss all this beauty, but that looks great. Thank Harry. That looks nice. That's Janessa. Ooh, slow pokes. So funny how far back some of them are. <laughs> like I don't think they sprint can sprint as fast as I can. Something. The carry's keeping up. There Here it is, High Rothgar. Beautiful place, to bitch to get to. Uh, 
hopefully we're not going to be disturbing them. They probably expect them any less. They have a way of knowing. Can I get ready to hit them over the head? No, that's fine. Uh, what's his name? He's probably meditating somewhere. Yeah, okay. I don't know. Uh -huh. Yeah, what am I happy to do? I really miss my friends from home. I like okay. playing cards with Lexi after Vesper. She'd almost always win. Yeah, I'm sure they won't mind. They're not gonna. Oh, yeah. oh. Uh, that was okay. That took those, right? All right, good. Thank you. Yes. Speak now if you think that was wrong. You know, I should have taken those. What's on the side? Okay, good. Plus, potion of regeneration is not really good. Oh, hey, yeah. oh, hey, hey. Sky above, voice within. Yeah, okay. Uh, I need a, a shout that to defeat all the one. Nothing big. Where did you learn of that? Who have you been talking to? Um. Hmm. Uh. Yeah. The blades, of course. Oops. They specialize in meddling in matters they barely understand. Their reckless arrogance knows no bounds. They have always sought to turn the Dragonborn from the path of wisdom. What? Have you learned nothing from us? Would you simply be a tool in the hands of the Blades to be used for their own purposes? Yeah, hold on here. I'm, I'm not their puppet. I'm trying to defeat all the Uh... Yeah. No, no, of course not. Forgive me, Dragonborn. I have been intemperate with yeah. But heed my warning. The blades may say they serve the dragonborn, but they do not. They never have. They, they don't. I, they don't need to serve me. I just wanted to feed all the way. No, I cannot teach it to you, because I do not know it. Hmm? It is called dragonrend, but its words of power are unknown to us. We do not regret this loss. Dragonrend holds no place within the way of the voice. Okay. Uh... Yeah, I thought you knew all the words. But not Dragonrend. The knowledge of that shout was lost in the time before history began. Perhaps only its creators ever knew it. But I am not the one to speak of it to you. All right. Uh, so if it's lost, I can't. Defeat him. Only Parthenax, the master of our order, can answer that question, if he so chooses. And who's that? He is our leader. He surpasses us all in his mastery of the way of the voice. Okay. He lives in seclusion on the very peak of the mountain. Oh, great. He speaks to us only rarely. And never to outsiders. Being allowed to see him is a great privilege. Uh, can I meet him? Only those whose voice is strong can find the path. We will teach you a shout to open the way to Parthenax. Okay. Thank you. Don't get too far ahead. I look for more potions. Potion of regeneration. Really? Sure, oh, that's good. Finally, something useful. All right, let's go. Let's go around this. Where'd they go? Hello? 
Oh, you're going outside. Oh, you're going outside. Okay. So where did everybody go? It's getting dark. That I'm in a rush or anything, but can you move it along? The path to Parthenax lies through this gate. I will show you how to open the way. Okay. Look. Ah. Cool. Grant okay. you my understanding of clear skies. This is your final gift from us, Dragonborn. Use it well. I will. Thank you. Clear skies will blow away the mist, but only for a time. The path to Parthenax is perilous, not to be embarked upon lightly. Keep moving, stay focused on your goal, and you will reach the summit. Okay. All right, ladies. I'm on dizzy a little bit. Ah, very nice. Don't worry, my lord. I'm the very sober. Is it that every place I go has giant spiders and rats? Look! Oh, can I get through this? Or is that? Oh. That's bad. It's a bad thing right there. Oh, I'm hurting the goat. <laughs> Sorry, goat. Oh, I lost the hole. I think I say that every time I see one. Oh, oh I got to this right to the throat. Oh, sorry. Oh, I was texting you through the hair. Sorry, it wasn't so bad. Um, 
Hmm. Is it about the same? Stop fall off, please. You will see it burn, it's burning right now. Phew. Oh, it's moving back. That stone's moving back, yeah. So it gives off some good light here. Ladies. Hmm. I'll get stuck behind the uh, snowy ice of doom. Actually, I don't need to saw it out to get light, do I? It's just regular wind. This goat has been like. Is this the same goat? Go! No. Crap! Clear skies works against the ice rates for any. I think it does so. Probably not. At least I feel comfortable. So it was good. So, what is an old hermit guy doing way up here, huh? Alright, this must be... ...in the line. Whoa. What the heck? <laughs> Does that make me drunk or something? <laughs> Throat of the world. Huh? There's a wall right here too, so it looks like we can... Uh oh. Alright, he's not attacking us. Drem Yolok. Greetings, Wundunik. I am Parthenax. Parthenax? Who are you? A dragon. What brings you to my Strumach, my mountain? Your Strumach, huh? Um. See, I was not expecting you to be a dragon. I am as my father Akatosh made me, as are you, Dovakin. Tell me, why do you come here, Volan? Why do you intrude on my meditation? Uh, I need to learn Dragon Run, Shao. Can you teach it? Hmm. Drem. Patience. There are formalities which must be observed at the first meeting of two of the Dove. Okay. By long tradition, the Elder speaks first. Hear my thum. Feel it in your bones. Match it if you are Dovakin. Okay. The word calls you. Go to it. A gift, Dovakin. Ah. Your 
understand fire as the dove do. A lot of sharing going on today. Thank you. I should feel warm after all that. Now, show me what you can do. Greet me not as mortal, but as Dova. Okay. Fire breath. Oh, uh, look out, lady. No! That was ah, kind yes. of pathetic, but okay. Sosedo <laughs> Vlostmul. The dragon blood runs strong in you. It is long since I had the pleasure of speech with one of my own kind. Okay. So, you have made your way here to me. No easy task for a jaw, mortal. Even for one of Dova Sos, dragon blood. What would you ask of me? Uh, can you teach me dragon rat? Ah, I have expected you, Proda. You would not come all this way for Tinvak with an old Dova. No, you seek your weapon against Alduin. I do. Uh... <laughs> do you know it or not? Uh, let's see. How did you know I came for dragon? Alduin Comate Teed. What else would you seek? Alduin and Dovakin return together. But I do not know the Thum you seek. Croesus, it cannot be known to me. Your kind. Jaw, mortals, created it as a weapon against the Dove, the dragons. Our Hadrime, our minds, cannot even comprehend its concepts. Hmm. Okay. So how can I learn it? Drem, all in good time. First, a question for you. Why do you want to learn this Thum? Uh, it's not your business. I need to stop Aldo. Yes, Alduin, Zemach, the elder brother, gifted, grasping, and troublesome, as is so often the case with firstborn. But why? Why must you stop Alduin? I've been asking myself that question for a long time. Um. Well, Prophet does, uh, does say the only the Dragonborn can stop him, and I face the reality that I am Dragonborn. Mm, true, but Kostid prophecy tells what may be, not what should be. Kostid Salo Ak, just because you can do a thing, does not always mean you should. Do you have no better reason for acting than destiny? Are you nothing but a plaything of Dez, of fate? Why does everybody think I'm a puppet? Um, I don't believe in destiny, but I will stop all that. And so perhaps your destiny will be fulfilled. Who can say? If I don't believe in it, who cares? <laughs> Desmot Mahus, even to the dove who ride the currents of time, destiny is elusive. Alduin believes that he will prevail with good reason, Rachmul. Because he's big and scared. And he is no fool, Nime. Rinik Gutnol, far from it. He began as the wisest and most far seeing of us all. But you have indulged my weakness for speech long enough. Croesus, now I will answer your question. Thank you. Hmm. 
Do you know why I live here, at the peak of the Monavin, what you name Throat of the World? Uh, <laughs> no dragons like mountains, right? Uh, I thought about it. This is the most sacred mountain in Skyrim, Sokravakstruma, the great mountain of the world. Okay. Here, the ancient tongues, the first mortal masters of the voice, brought Alduin to battle and defeated him. Using the dragon. Mm, yes and no. Viknuznikaron. Alduin was not truly defeated either. Oh, yeah, if he here, was, so. you would not be here today seeking to defeat him. That's a good point. The Nords of those days used the Dragonrend shout to cripple Alduin. But this was not enough. Ok Mulag Unslad. It was the Kel, the Elder Scroll. They used it to cast him adrift on the currents of time. Uh, so you're saying that the ancient Nord sent Alduin forward in time? Mm, not intentionally. Some hoped he would be gone forever, forever lost. Maye. I knew better. Tidbo Amativ. Time flows ever onward. One day he would surface. Which is why I have lived here. For thousands of mortal years, I have waited. I knew where he would emerge, but not when. Alright, uh, so yeah, how does this help me? Tidkrent. Time was shattered here because of what the ancient Nords did to Alduin. If you brought that Kel, that Elder Scroll, back here to the Teed Ahran, the Time Wound, with the Elder Scroll that was used to break time, you may be able to cast yourself back to the other end of the break. You could learn Dragonrend. From those who created it. Uh, okay. Alright, so I'm sure I can't find this at any bookstore anywhere in Skyrim, so where do I find it? Krosis, no. I know little of what has passed below in the long years I have lived here. You are likely better informed than I. Yeah, great. Oh, well, yeah, I guess that's Bernard and our gear and car <laughs> whatever his name is I have an idea trust your instincts Dovahkiin your blood will show you the way all right so um yeah, so what what does a dragon win actually do I cannot tell you in detail. I never heard it used. Kogan. It was the first Thum created solely by mortals. It was said to force a dragon to experience the concept of mortality. A truly von Mindoran. Incomprehensible idea to the immortal Dove. Okay. Uh, so when I do find the other scroll, what then? Return it here to the Tid Ahran. Then, Kele Vomindok. Nothing is certain with such things. But I believe the scroll's bond with the Tid Ahran will allow you a, a seeing, a vision of the moment of its creation. Then you will...
will feel no dragonrend in the power of its first expression. You will see them, Wuthfadon, my friends, Haken, Gormleth, Feldir. And who are they? The first mortals that I taught the Thum, the first tongues, the leaders of the rebellion against Alduin. They were mighty in their day, even to attempt to defeat Alduin, Sahrot Hun. The Nords have had many heroes since, but none greater. Okay. Drem your lock, greetings. Well, he seems to want to help. So he's gonna leave. Good. Do you have to make that rocket? Alright, so we made a new friend here, a dragon. Uh, <laughs> And it uh, looks like we need to find an Elder Scroll, so um, well, we'll go back down and talk to the Greybeards and see if they know anything, and if not, um, maybe Esbern knows. Uh, at this point, it's pretty much up in the air where we're going to find one, so um, I guess our best bet would be to start with the Greybeards. Uh, so yeah, I think we'll, we'll do that, and uh, is there something? Hold on, I'm sorry. Speak. Uh, I will listen. That's a sword, isn't it? Dragon Brand. What is that? Alright, who is here? Hold that thought, what I was talking about before. Dragon Bane, Dragon Brand. Oh, it's a two handed sword. Okay. Wish I can see what it looks like. Oh, that looks. Kind of cool, isn't it? Don't worry. I'll play my. Uh, I, I could carry it. Just make it look really cool. That is pretty awesome. I, I've never seen that before. I think that's. I think that's from a mod. Yeah, I think that's from the. Um, the Jesus swords. I'm not sure. I don't want to say what's wrong because I'm wrong. I felt bad. I'm right behind you. Uh, all right, hold on. Let's give this. How can I serve you, my thane? I need you to carry some stuff. I am so. I am overburdened. As usual. Just until we get down to the horses. Let's get going then. Okay, we will, but not now. We'll get going next episode. Uh, so yeah, thank every, thank you for watching, and um, oh, that's a nice picture right there. Um, yeah, so you know, next episode we'll go see the. So my eyes are all screwed up here. Um, we'll go see the Greybeard, see what they know. If they know anything, we'll go see Esburn. Hopefully, he knows. Um, if not, I don't know. Maybe the maybe the college at Winterhold might might have an idea. Um, so we're gonna check that out uh, on the next episode. So for now, I uh, thank you for watching. Uh, please remember to hit that thumbs up and uh, if you haven't subscribed perfect opportunity to do so at the end of the uh, the video the little subscribe button down there just click it bring it to my page and you can subscribe um, and if you do that that'll be great thank you